Hey guys, Miss Claudia here, and we have another experiment for us to do today. Well, uh, more so of a craft that we're gonna make today. Um, but we're going to make puffy sidewalk paint. Yep, so it's something for us to kind of experiment and play with and then go outside and use. Um, so let's go through what we have as far as ingredients for what we're gonna do today. You're gonna need a bowl and a spoon. You're gonna need a cup of flour. You're gonna need a tablespoon of dish soap and you're gonna need a cup of water. You're also gonna need a squeeze bottle to put your sidewalk paint in once we're done making it. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. We're gonna measure out a cup of flour in our measuring cup. Gonna add that to our bowl. And there we're gonna measure out a cup of water. I'm going to add that as well. And then we're going to add a tablespoon of dish soap to the mix. I forgot to mention, but it is optional, but you can add different food coloring to it to make it whatever color you want. I think we're going to go with blue today. So we're gonna add 10 drops of food coloring to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. We're gonna give that a good mix. It's gonna look very weird coming together. It's gonna be kind of gross looking or kind of cool depending upon what you think about it. But we're gonna mix it real good. Remember, this is not edible because it has dish soap in it. Really good. And you see how it's getting kind of puffy? I'm gonna try to get most of the lumps out. And it's really just gonna become a smooth batter. Good. That's about the consistency that you want it. So we'll set our spoon to the side. And the final thing that we need to do is add it to our squeeze bottle. So we're just going to take, I found a small measuring cup that has a little spout on it. And that'll help us to be able to pour it into the bottle. It might get a little messy, but that's okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish pouring this in and then we will meet back outside and see what it looks like. All right guys, so now we're outside and we're gonna see how it turns out. I also made a batch of yellow earlier, so now we have two colors to play with. Um, if you don't have a squeeze bottle like this, you can also use an old bottle of dish soap. That might be actually a little bit easier to get the mix inside of the bottle. So we're gonna go ahead and play with it and see what we can get. So it works really well. You can make whatever shapes you want. Make a star, a heart. Let's see what the yellow looks like. This is pink baby. Rectangle. Thank you. Triangle. And if you're feeling really good about it, you can actually make letters too. Alright, so we miss you guys. We hope to see you guys in person soon. But until then, we will see you next week for another video. Have a good one.